No bowls. But don't worry, there are plenty of other ways to use them. Duncan Hines Oven Ready Homestyle Brownies. The breakthrough for brownie lovers. Welcome to now. Now is like a scary movie, because now is that dangerous time of night when you fall victim to chocolate temptations lurking in the kitchen. Good thing you know, there's a nighttime snack you don't have to be afraid of. Special K Chocolatey Delight Cereal. With ice cold milk, it's a lower calorie snack that won't undo your whole day. What's the difference between indulging and overindulging? Now you know, the difference is K. Go to Yahoo and search Special K for more chocolatey snacks. Okay, family pair picked up another $500, and Kenny, you played well there. You're up against a very good uh, team. They're tough. You should be able to tie it up with a little luck. We're going to begin this game two. Family pair has game one. We're going to start with the letter M. Answer starts with M. Everybody ready? And here we go. What M is a light, colorful fabric that gets its name from the city in India? Yes, Eleanor. Madras. Madras is right, where it is manufactured. Correct. Where to? Oh, <laughs> I thought I was through. <laughs> uh, no, you have to hang in there with us. Let's try C. Okay, let her see. Here comes a C question. What C can have from 28 to 354 legs? Yes, Kenny. Centipede. Centipede's the right answer. Kenny, you're in there. <laughs> there <are> your hands. <laughs> Even though. Even though its name means 100 feet. Uh, very few of them have exactly 100. I don't know who bothers counting, but that's the way it runs. Kenny, where to? T-bill. Okay, well, T-bill. They're a very good investment right. these days. <laughs> yes. I recommend them highly. Backed by the full faith and credit of Goodson Todman. <laughs> uh, yeah, believe me. Our T question answer begins with T, so everybody ready. What T was invaded by Mongols in 1220? Yes, Eleanor. Tartary. No, repeat it for you, Kenny. Good shot for you now. What tea was invaded by Mongols in 1220 and was the location of the American embassy in Iran? Tehran. Tehran is the right answer. You got that one, Kenny. Be quick, I'm too quick. The J, right. please. Okay, Kenny's going for the J, trying to make top bottom connection. Everybody ready? Here it comes. What J is the J in basketball's Dr. J? And that's Eleanor. Irving. Nope. Oh, Repeat it for oh, you, Julius. Kenny. What J is the J in basketball's Dr. J? Julius. Julius is the correct answer, Kenny. The rules, of course, as you understand, Eleanor, I know. we accept your first answer and then go, and even though you threw in the right one. You, I was we, right, I am stupid you, sometimes. <laughs> no, you're not. You are, you are not. You're sweet and right and nice. Kenny, you're, you're all right. I'm yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Call you sweet, but I, where you want to go? <laughs> D, please. And if Kenny gets this, he ties the he ties nice. the match. Game of peace. Picks up five hundred bucks. Okay, everybody, ready? What D is the tiny creature that couldn't stay awake? <laughs> Eleanor. Dormouse. At the Mad Hatter's tea party. Dormouse is right. Okay. <laughs> Boy, I threw a block in on you Ooh, there, Ken. Where are you going, Eleanor? S. Okay. Letter S. We'll read this quickly. And... Oh, right now we'll uh, we'll pause. Be back with letter S. But first, we thought you might want to see this. <laughs> it's GSN's new four-hour happy hour. You can get together with your friends and check out the hotties. But watch out for the whammy. Four hours of your favorite game shows. Weekday afternoons starting at 3 on GSN. Fact. You're receiving a structured settlement from a lawsuit. Fact. It's being paid out over years. Question. Should you wait to get your money down the road? Or get a cash lump sum now. Call Peachtree Settlement Funding. Get cash for credit cards, medical bills, or a down payment on a house. No one has more expertise than Peachtree in turning your structured settlement into cash today. And that's a fact. Life doesn't wait. Why should you? Call now, 1-800-693-7905. Do you have questions about mesothelioma? If you or someone you know has been diagnosed with mesothelioma in the last five years, call now for a free book. The book, written by medical professionals who have treated mesothelioma, will answer your questions about this disease. 
Call the Mountie Rakel Law Firm toll-free 1-888-USA-MISO. There's no obligation, so call 1-888-USA-MESO. Here at the phone company, you've been our customer for a long time. Now Vonage wants to change all that. Well, over two million people have already switched to Vonage. Oh, really? <laughs> Don't they miss having phone service? Actually, with Vonage, you get the number one rated digital phone service with unlimited local and long distance calls for just $24.99 a month. What do you charge? <laughs> It's simple, really. It starts with different basic rates, long distance fees, and of course, different packages have different features, and some fe well, uh, Vonage oh. has over 25 features, and they're included for no extra charge. For me, Vonage is everything I want in a phone service. It's dependable. It's perfect. No nickels and dimes uh, like the phone company. Sign up now with Vonage and get one month free. Enjoy clear digital phone sound quality using your high-speed internet connection. Okay, but making a change is hard, and for over 100 years, the only thing we've changed is... Your prices? <laughs> Whoa! Call 1-800-590-8124 or go online to betterwaytophone.com. Okay, ready now. Here's the board. Here comes that S question. It couldn't be read earlier, but it can be now. What S is surrounded by 14 diamonds on Lady... Yes? Sapphire. Eleanor. Sapphire is the right answer, Eleanor. You're right. <laughs> On Lady Diana's engagement ring. Now well, look at the family pair come ripping in there. Where are you going now, Eleanor? E. Okay, that'll connect you on that side. Get ready to block Kenny and get the pick back if you can. What E was the biblical land of Cush and is located across the red... <laughs> yes, who's that? That's... Yes, Kitty. Ethiopia. Ethiopia is the right answer, <laughs> Kitty. You've got it. I didn't see the light there for a moment. The biblical land of Cush, located across the Red Sea from Saudi Arabia. Well, now look where we are. Where to? W. The letter W. You want this and you want it badly, oh, Kenny. I, oh, I'll take oh, it. Yeah, yeah. You get it. You get back in there and a chance to pick. The family pair picks it up. They win the game and the match. Here we go. Everybody ready now? What W does Texas produce more of than any other state, and Australia more of than any other country. For the game, Kitty. Wheat. No, repeat it for you, Kenny, a break. What W does Texas produce more of than any other state, and Australia more than any other country? Please do not help. Wine. No? <laughs> Wool. Oh. Wool. That was a good one. <laughs> I don't think there's much wine produced no, not in at Texas, all. is there, Bob? <laughs> I didn't ask what was drank, drunk, <laughs> or who. Okay, here's another W question, and again, it's possible game and match for the family pair. Kenny to block. What W is the dog that resulted from a terrier mating with an Italian greyhound? Yes. I'm going to take a guess. Wolfhound? Nope. Another break for you, Kenny. What W is the dog that resulted from a terrier? Mating with an Italian greyhound. Kenny? No idea. Whippet. Oh. The Whippet. Looks a lot like a greyhound, but smaller. It was better. It was a lot better than wine, Kenny. <laughs> it was an ugly dog. <laughs> what W resulted <laughs> from, a, from a, a greyhound mating with an Italian terrier? Wine. I think, I think I'd rather have wine. Anyone knows that. Anyway, here comes another W question. Ready or not, we're coming at you. What W have nostrils in the top of their heads? <laughs> Eleanor. Whales. Whales is right, and that's game and match for you. Okay. Family pair here again. Game and match and another thousand dollars. The rest of that question, nostrils in the top of their heads and inspired the expression, thar she blows. Wales, of course. Thank you, Kenny. Thank you. You played well. You ran up against a good team. Have some very nice consolation prizes for you. Sit and be comfortable. We'll Thank be back much. in just a moment, but right now I thought we'd pause for this. <laughs> Back. 
Why do I love my Voluminous Mascara more than any other? Because it's positively unflakable. Unlike other mascaras. Now my lashes, unbelievably full. Unflakable. Even when they're five times fuller. So go ahead. Wink them, blink them, bat them, love Voluminous Mascara from L'Oreal. Harfest 2007. Eight films to die for. For ticket information, go to horrorfestonline.com. Just hear those bells jing jingle and ring. Use the music and magic of Snow What Fun Sledders to surprise your family. Just $14.95 when you buy three cards. Only at today's Hallmark Gold Crown Stores. The incumbent has not run a clean campaign. Dirty tactics, spotty performance. There's a trail of dirt leading right to your door. Your response? It's time for your mop to step down. Get the five signs of clean with Swiffer Wet Jet. It cleans better than a mop. Wet Jet traps the dirt that mops can leave behind. For a clean, you can see. The floor is all yours. Visible clean. One of the five signs Swiffer gives cleaning a whole new meaning. Visit Swiffer.com for a $5 coupon. Di Sirono on the rocks. Di Sirono on the rocks. Come out. Yeah. Di Sirono's warm and sensual taste makes you wish it would never end. Di Sirono. Pass the pleasure around. Now you can play America's favorite quiz show anytime you want. It's the Jeopardy home game. Pop in the DVD with three wireless buzzers. You're ready to play. Experience all the excitement of Jeopardy, including daily doubles, final Jeopardy, video clues, and more. Hosted by Alex Trebek. Some toilet paper is soft, uh -oh. but not very strong. Others are strong, Yikes. but not very soft. Cottonelle Ultra Toilet Paper is both soft mm. and strong. Dreamy. $1,400 total winning for the family pair now, plus $1,000 for that game, that's $2,400. Now you get a chance to really bounce it up there by five. So, Eleanor, you gonna do it yourself? I'm gonna try. Eleanor, our captain, wait till I push my button. Come on over here, we're gonna give you a chance at another $5,000. There you are, I can help you down the thing there. Oh, all my questions. That's beautiful. I put the questions in a box here when I'm finished with them, and there's no bottom in the box. You want me to help you pick them and they're up? All, fortunately, they're questions we've used, so kindly upon leaving, do not step on the all questions, right. Eleanor. Right. You know how this works, don't you? Yes. Okay, you start at the left, you make a path, and the moment you make the connection, left to right, you pick up $5,000. If you miss or pass, we put a block up. But because some of the questions are easier than others, you should be able to work your way around that. All right, you have 60 seconds total time. We wish you luck. Hope you do the whole five this time. I hope so. The Thanks. clock will start counting down when you tell me where you want to uh, start. I think I'll start with HD. Host of Over Easy. I don't know. JK. Father of John, Robert, and Ted. Uh, Joseph Kennedy. Right. VR. A country dance. Virginia Real. Right. CB. Starred Jane Fonda and Lee Marvin. Oh, Cat Bellew. Right. Uh, S-O-L. A gift from France. Oh, Statue of Liberty. Right. A-S. An L. Jolson hit. Uh, pass. B-M-L. Mario Lanza hit. Oh, Be My Love. That's it. You did it. Congratulations. Well <laughs> done. Oh, Good job. I didn't even know I knew the whole thing. Well, you did. Good job. Thank you. There they are. Look what's happening in Little Tykes Land. This is the Smarter Kitchen. The Little Tykes Kitchen. Measuring, mixing, just like Mom. Put the pink frosting on the cake. You got it right. Now that's the Smart Kitchen. Little Tykes Cook and Learn Kitchen. Accessory pack sewed separately. Batteries not included. Where did I park my car? Oh, no. 
If you have trouble remembering what you don't write down, now there's an easy way to remember everything. It's called My Lil Reminder, the digital voice recorder that records without tape. Blue section, row 18. Then reminds you later. Blue section, row 18. Just press the button to record. Milk, juice, butter, and eggs. Then play back your reminder when it's time. Micro technology makes it smaller than a business card, perfect for your purse, pocket, or briefcase. Or slip one on your key ring and you'll remember everything. It's left on Main Street, then go two miles and right on out. So easy, even a child can use it. Don't forget I'll be at Grandma's till 5. The number is 555-28247. Perfect for shopping lists, directions, phone numbers, the office, even at school. Read chapters 6 and 7 for Friday. And look. My Lil Reminder even has a built-in LED flashlight to give you a little extra light whenever you need it. Use it as a message center for the entire family. Honey, don't forget to pick up Jessica at 7. Other digital voice recorders can cost up to $100, but through this special TV offer, you can get My Lil Reminder with built-in flashlight direct from the manufacturer for only $9.99. And because everyone in your family will want one, call now and we'll send you a second one absolutely free. You just pay shipping and handling. That's right, you get two My Lil Reminder digital voice recorders with built-in LED flashlights. And best of all, you get them both for only $9.99. But don't forget to call. Don't forget to call. This offer is not available in stores, so call now. Here's how to order. Call 1-800-760-6402 to order My Little Reminder for only $9.99, and we'll send you a second one absolutely free. So call 1-800-760-6402. That's 1-800-760-6402. Call now. Let nothing stop you in the pursuit of your passion, not even body aches. Excedrin introduces a choice for targeting tough pain. Excedrin back and body, fast, powerful relief. Its dual ingredient formula works two ways, as a pain reliever and a pain blocker, right where it hurts, so the pain stops. You don't. Excedrin. Go. It's like a family reunion with every episode. Family Feud is next. Then you'll laugh all the way to the blank on Match Game, followed by Password Plus. Stay tuned. Eleanor, congratulations. Thank you. You did a marvelous job. Now, you were a little uneasy on that first one, but now I think you have your tempo, and you have 7,000. I'm a slow learner. <laughs> I don't think so. You said before that you didn't even know you knew some of those answers. Right? That happens sometimes. You play very well, both of you. We'll expect you back next time. We'll introduce you to another solo player and see what you can do there, okay? Thank you. Well, it'd be awfully nice if you could come around. We'd appreciate it. We shall cry and hold our breath if you don't. Goodbye. <laughs> Uh, hi, Dad. Hi. Uh, I don't really need your help, but I just wanted to let you know that I'm going to win the million dollars. <laughs> because the U.S. president appeared on Laughing as Richard Nixon. That's my final answer. He's won a million dollars! It's time for the Family Feud, introducing the Elrod family. Gertrude, Juanita, Janet, Billy, and Dan, ready for action. And the Tayeda family. Ineda, Mike, Mariana, Margarita, and Joaquin. On your marks, let's start the Family Feud. With the star of Family Feud, Richard Dawson. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Last show we did, we had a question about uh, the Lee family, and we were, we're calling New York. We're still waiting for an answer from New York. ABC made more money than any network and can't get an executive on the phone. It's because they use a Dixie cup and a cotton line. <laughs> anyway, we'll let you know. The champs, meanwhile, are the l -Rock. You got a lot of moolah there, dear. $18,845. Yeah. Made them all. 
This is my sister, Juanita. My Hi. daughter, Janet. Hi. Hello. My daughter, Billy. Hello, Richard. Who Bill? produced? <laughs> Didn't he? No, I mean, yeah. Billy produced. She sure did. The guy who wears the same suit day in and day out, Lucky Dan. Lucky Dan. He's kind of cool. He's a good player, though. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Now, listen, when we had that last show, you mentioned something about Vegas. Are you going to go to Vegas? Oh, I went there for New Year's. Did you? Mm-hmm. Have a good time? Oh, I had a good time. Win any money? Oh, yeah. <laughs> of course, if you're going to lie to us, I'm going to meet well, this I... family. <laughs> How do I say your name? Because it's a Spanish name. I want to pronounce it correctly. Cayeda. I think that's wrong, but we'll give it a whirl. <laughs> Cayeda. Oh, yeah. How are you? Hi, Richard. Cayeda. 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 How do I say that? Well, you can try two ways. You can say it the correct way, which is Eneida. Eneida? Eneida. That's very, yeah, that's like Castilian. Yes. Barcelona. They... <laughs> well, it's not with the TH, but... Well, but it's similar. You say it, say it again. Eneida. Eneida. Right. Very good. I said that once on Hollywood Boulevard. <laughs> Eneida. The guy said, can I help you? <laughs> You're very pretty. What's the incorrect way? Anita. Yeah, I don't like that. I and like then, And Eneida. then sometimes if they get both my names wrong, it comes out Anita Kalita. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, you're kind of neat, huh? <laughs> Let's meet your family. Okay, I have my husband, Mike. Nice and my sister-in-law, Mariana. Hello. And my sister-in-law, Margarita. Hello. And my brother-in-law, Joaquin. How you doing, Richard? Well, you're all from Ireland, huh? <laughs> <laughs> where, well, where it's you... an island. No, where? Spanish name from where? Cuba. Cuba. Really? Mm-hmm. How all... many of you have been to Cuba? I mean, lived, truly. Oh, we no, all... because I talked to them, and they said, well, no, our mom and dad. Were you all no, born no, there? We're all born in Cuba. When did you all leave? 62. Six, that's the year I came here. What was you heard I was coming yeah. here? You said, well, let's leave this place. That's right. That's right. Well, it's time to play the feud then. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Well, now, did people survey top five answers on the board? You've got to try and find the most popular answer. Here's the question. Baltic Avenue is one square on a Monopoly board. Name another. <laughs> Miss Enthusiasm, yes. Madison Square. Madison? <laughs> Not there. Okay, how about Boardwalk? Boardwalk! Yeah. Number one. Play it, play it. We're gonna play, Richard. <laughs> Gertie, I love you, honey. Look, she's gonna sit up there and play. They're all plopping back there. Good to see you, Mikhail. <laughs> Baltic Avenue is one square on the Monopoly board. Name another. What about Park Place? Okay. Yeah. Park Place! You've got it. That's the way to do it, Mikhail. Marijuana. Oh, no, no, no. Mariana. I'm sorry. Uh, well, sometimes Silent J. Uh, what um, do you think? Do you ever play this game, by the way? Uh, Monopoly? It's a good game. Mm, yeah, but I don't play it very often. You don't often. play it, well. <laughs> but how about um, Jail? The Jail? Jail? Oh, that's good. That's good. Hail! A little joke there, I silent J and said, Hail. Oh, yes. I got it. Hmm. Well, all right. <laughs> Margarita, they named it Drink Amp here. That's, so that's what I say. They should, they should name it Drink Amp here. Not after you, because I can't say your name. <laughs> You've got a strike, you get three of those to get a chance to steal. Baltic Avenue, one square on Monopoly board, name another. Park Avenue. <laughs> that, is that not the same? Or not? I, yeah, I think it's the same, though. Um... You ever played the game? No, never play. What's your favorite game? Well, I'll talk to you about that later. Fam <laughs> Family Feud. What was it? I was hoping uh, it was, good answer. Hoping it was doctor and nurse. Um, no, I'll pass. Pardon? I'm gonna pass. I can't oh, think of anything. Oh, she can't think of anything. All right. Uh, okay. Okay. Are, you are you a player? Player of this game? Sure, I've Okay, give me a good answer. Okay, how about BNO Railroad? Ah. Oh, right. The old B&O Railroad. If you say you're okay, if not third, strike B&O Railroad. Not now. $69, Gertrude. The electric company. The electric company. Need an answer. The electric company. Ah, oh, I'll go one better. Sesame Street. Yeah, that's a good one. Electric company say you get the $69. If not, we're going to give it to... Cayeda. Pardon? Cayeda? No, your name. Oh, Anita. 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 Electric company! Oh. Number three! 
Harry Blandek, number four. Go to jail. Oh, that would be different than jail. No, that's go. That's a different square, Angel. You land on that. You remember, work on the Mississippi. Number <laughs> five, Pacific <laughs> Avenue. All right, well, what am I explaining to you anyway? You got the money. We want to return right after this. Have you heard about the internet's best bingo destination? Try BigTimeBingo.net, where the fun never stops and it's absolutely free to play. It's easy to get started. Just go to BigTimeBingo.net, download and install the free software, register to play, and start having fun. They have all your favorite games, fun chat, and prizes. It's easy. So don't wait. Be a winner and join today. BigTimeBingo.net. BigTimeBingo.net. Every day we use signs to inform us and help us make decisions at a glance. So why are the signs so complicated when it comes to choosing the food we eat? Kellogg's cereals now include guideline daily amounts, which shows, at a glance, what's in a serving of Kellogg's cereal and the percentage it contributes to your daily diet. Nutrition at a glance. It's a good sign. From Kellogg's. Excuse me. Do you have a second to talk? Have a seat. Do you want to lay your head on my shoulder? Use the music and magic of Snow White Fun Sledders to surprise your family. Just $14.95 when you buy three cards. Only at today's Hallmark Gold Crown Stores. I can't believe these people. $69 there. Nothing there. Come on. Juanita. Juanita. Well, Juan, if we, you know. Yeah, yeah. That's just, right. Just one hand, unless you're doing a lie detector test. <laughs> just one. Or we'll do your nails, whichever you like to do. No, is that the hand you want there? That's the one. Okay. For this uh, question, we asked 100 children of the Robert Fulton Jr. High School, okay? And uh, who was it? Mr. Whitaker was the summer principal. We thank him. We asked 100 children. Junior high school age, a question. Top seven answers are up there on the board, and this is what we ask the kids. If you could have anything for dinner tonight, what would you choose? Yeah. Ice cream. Ice cream! <laughs> Not there. Pizza. Pizza! Number one. Play or pass? We're gonna play, Richard. We're gonna play. Get him. I can't believe. Ice cream didn't make it. How are you, dear? I'm fine. Thank Good you. Lordy. Remember now, high school kids. Yes. Junior high school. I was in high school, school once. Well, really? <laughs> Many moons ago. Oh. Okay, I would say hamburgers. Good Good. Ready? Right. What is a hamburger? You got it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, how about a taco? Oh! Okay. Yeah. Any of our kids say taco? Hey, Dad. Here's your lucky suit. All right. Junior high school kids. Spare ribs. Spare ribs? <laughs> All right, Dad. Yeah. All right. In the film Deep South. Spare ribs? <laughs> First time he let us down in a long time. That's a strike, Gertie. You know that? Three of those, they got a chance to stand. Well, maybe they like a hot dog. Oh, Good oh, answer. Yeah. The Robert Conrad Syndrome Hot Dog. He said to the 100 junior high school kids, if you could have anything for dinner tonight, what would you choose? Enchilada. Oh, oh good answer. 
just north of San Diego. Enchilada! Second strike. Steak. Good. Ah. Good. Steak! You got it. Spaghetti. Oh, good answer. Good answer. You say you're okay if not third strike. Spaghetti! Bless you. Hear that person's name? I hear all those things. You have to call? <laughs> if you have anything for dinner tonight, what would you choose? Three seconds. Apple pie. Why not? Oh, Apple yeah. pie, say so you got it. If not, they get a chance to steal. Apple pie! <laughs> not there. $74 waiting for it. Jelly. Okay. Yeah, right. Peanut butter and jelly. There, you get the 74. Big lead in the game. If not, it's going to be pretty even because they get it. Peanut butter and jelly. Oh. Number three. Chicken. Chicken. You could have anything for dinner tonight. What would you choose? Not one of them said Raquel Well. <laughs> we'll be back right after this. Intrepid, portentous, potent, vital, empowering, momentous. Learn more words. They can take you places you've never imagined. Dreamed of. Conceived. Join GSN in spreading the word about the importance of a dynamic vocabulary. Tell a student to enter the National Vocabulary Championship. Go to winwithwords.com. The free vocabulary resource. And help a kid win with words. Get your school involved. Go to usatodayeducation.com. You don't have to suffer. Premier Bathrooms brings freedom to your life. My wife had a fear of falling in the bath. I was having difficulty getting in and out the regular bathtubs. Premier Bathrooms custom bath and shower enclosures are easy to step into. Features sturdy hand grips and safety bars, secure locking mechanisms, and comfortable seats. Every Premier Bathroom tub and shower is backed by an unconditional, no quibble guarantee on all parts and labor. It feels so safe. That's what I like about it. You don't have to worry about um, getting in and out. Very, very happy I've got it. What better thing is there? Premier walk-in baths come complete with bath fittings and accessories to bring value and beauty to your home. Ease away tension and pain with Premier Bathroom's patented hydrotherapy jets. Premier Bathrooms has meant freedom and safety to thousands of customers across Europe and North America. Call 1-888-325-4193 for a free information kit. So do you believe in Santa? I believe in cashmere. <laughs> Burlington Coat Factory. Holiday dressing up for the family with fabulous brands at famously low prices. Burlington Coat Factory. Just look at you now. Made from fresh tomatoes living happily together with spicy green chilies. The bold flavor of Rotel gives your queso a kick. Spice things up with Rotel. Duncan Hines introduces oven-ready homestyle brownies. They go straight from the freezer to the oven to delicious. Duncan Hines oven-ready homestyle brownies. The breakthrough for brownie lovers. Look what's happening in Little Tykes Land. Little Tykes has the coolest workshop. You flip it over and it's two in one. Wood shop on one side and motor shop on the other. Whoa! It has realistic power tools. So, grinder, drill. Little Tykes build and to learn workshop. Better not include it. Something new for lunch? Smoked chicken panini. Really? Mmm. Toasted Tuscan bread. With the goodness of whole grain. Mmm. Let's make this for a healthy choice. I did. Introducing delicious panini from Healthy Choice. Take a look at the score now. We got $74 over there and $69 over there. Come, come. Pass, pass, play, play. <laughs> Finally went over the top. <laughs> Didn't answer any. Pop, pop, right, pop. Uh, the dollar values are doubled. 100 people surveyed. Top six answers are on the board. Here's a question Name a weapon used in ancient times. Yeah. A sword. A sword! Yeah. Well, no, baby. Uh, a weapon used in ancient times. A uh, bow and arrow. 
Bow and arrow! You got it. What are you going to do? Okay. We're going to play. We're going to play it, Madonna. Billy? Weapon used in ancient times. Okay, real ancient times. I'm going to say a slingshot. Okay. Ooh, One slingshot. First oh. Dan? A spear. Oh, good answer. Yeah. Spear. Brother did that in the Olympics. Spear, mm. spear catching. <laughs> uh, weapon used in ancient times. Uh, dart. Dart. <laughs> Good answer, Mom. Dart. <laughs> yes, dear. Well, uh, do you think they threw rocks? I do, indeed. <laughs> They've thrown them here on recent times. I'm sure ancient times. Yeah, rocks there. You're okay. If not, third strike. Rock. Cannon. Yes. All righty. Cannons there, you're all right. If not, third strike. Cannon! Oh. Not there. Here's a chance for you. $146 waiting. How about club? Okay. Yeah. Club is there, you get the 146. If not, Al Rod will get it. Club! Yeah. Very good. Number six. Catapult. 215, 74. Let's go. What is the catapult, the difference between a catapult and a slingshot? Size. Size? Okay. Just asking. Got to learn these things, haven't you? Absolutely. I think he's wrong. Dollar values are double. 100 people surveyed. Top four answers are on the board. Here's the question. Name something you'd really be upset to discover you had forgotten to put on in the morning. Bra. <laughs> Bra! <laughs> Number one answer. What are you going to do? Yeah, we're going to play. We're going to play. Okay. All right. Just checking. <laughs> <laughs> Name something you really be upset to discover you'd forgotten to put on in the morning. Your arid. Oh, I mean deodorant. Your arid, right, Dan. All right. <laughs> The order it. Yeah. How about your shoes? Yeah. Okay. How about your shoes? First strike. Boy, oh boy. Well. <laughs> Sorry. Just dozed uh, off for a second. Three seconds. Oh, well, if you wore dentures, how about right. dentures? Okay. <laughs> Down one, no. Gabby Hayes, huh? Dangers! Right there. Oh, no. I'm old. Yes, sir, you tried one. Something you'd really be upset to discover you've forgotten to put on in the morning. Um, a watch. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Hi, Love Tool. Uh, if watch is there, you're okay. If not, third strike. Watch! Yeah! Well, Billy, if you met this one, I love him. What do you think? How about your clothes? Good answer. Well, All right. Sure. Take a look. Your clothes are up there. No. Clothes are up. Then when You know what I'm saying, don't you? Just say. Clothes. <laughs> Not now. There's enough up there to make you the champs. What do you say? How about some makeup? Make Okay, uh, Richard, we're, we're gonna say makeup. Makeup. Right. Makeup's there. You're the champs. If not, you get the money. Makeup! Oh. Oh. I thought you were going all the way there. We got $74 plus $18,845. Oh. I want to tell you that I'm going to miss, miss all of you, but we've been on the air about four years. Male or female, we never had anyone who had a brighter, better wit, and a better sense of humor. You were great. I love you. Bye. Thank you. And it works. Who will play? First? She's going first. Money right after we watch this. Get it.
<laughs> I'm Mark Goldston, Chairman and CEO of Net Zero. All Internet providers take you to the same Internet, so why pay more to get there? Net Zero is only $9.95 a month, and we give you a 30-day money-back guarantee. Call 1-800-NET-ZERO or visit netzero.com. So, Miss Coat Authority, what's hot? Rich wool, that's hot. Luxurious leathers, that's hot. Saving money, that's hot. Save big on top brand coats for everyone. Burlington Coat Factory, the Coat Authority. Name someone you wouldn't want to get a phone call from. My mother-in-law. My mother-in-law? Show me mother-in-law. I am amazing. Your answers could win cash and prizes. Play Family Feud online at worldwinner.com. When you're on treatment for rheumatoid arthritis, everyday things can still be tough to handle. Can you pull this? Fasten this? Grasp this? Oh, yes, I can. What about you? If you think your treatment isn't helping enough, ask your rheumatologist about Orencia. It's an RA treatment that's proven to make a difference for many patients who weren't helped enough by other treatments. Relieving the symptoms of RA and controlling the advance of joint damage. Do not take Orencia with another biologic medicine for RA due to an increased risk of serious infection. Orencia can cause serious side effects, including serious infections. Rare cases of certain cancers have been reported. Tell your doctor if you are prone to or have any infection like an open sore or the flu, or if you have or had COPD, a chronic lung disease. Orencia may worsen your COPD. Talk with your doctor about Orencia. Why wrestle with the little things you can't do if you could be saying, oh, yes, I can. Hey, Mesa. Is that right? Yeah. And who have we got off stage? My brother-in-law, Joaquin, and fellow Trojan. Oh. Yeah, OK. Fellow Trojan. Fellow Trojan. Joaquin. Joaquin. That's right. These, these feet were made for Joaquin. Joaquin. You got it. This is for luck. Thank Get you. the money. 15 seconds, please. Right. How much do you tip a delivery boy for carrying your groceries to the car? 30 cents. Name something you should know by heart. Alphabets. A fruit used in pies. Apple. A sign of the zodiac. Gemini. A kind of stew. Uh, beef stew. Turn around. <laughs> How much do you tip a delivery boy for taking the groceries to the car? <laughs> you probably spend about an hour looking for this, don't yeah. you? 30 cents. <laughs> Survey said. Oh, my goodness. Something you should know by heart. You said. A, B, R, F, right. survey set, zero. Oh. Fruit used in pies, you said apple, survey set. There you go. <laughs> sign of the zodiac, you said, is that your sign? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> my sign's yield. <laughs> survey set, four. Sign of stew, you said, beef, survey set. One yeah! over five, the We made over a hundred. Here's Joaquin, let's go. <laughs> we'll ask the same questions I asked your sister while you cannot duplicate her answers. If you do you hear this, I'll say try again, you give me another answer, okay? Okay. All righty, please remind everyone the answers Anita gave us. Give me 20 seconds on the clock, please. If you win the money, I want you to get all the easy names to pronounce, okay? <laughs> okay? Okay. Sure, quit. Here we go. Who did I? Yeah, I told you to do that. Yeah. How much do you tip a delivery boy for carrying your groceries to the car? A dollar. Name something you should know by heart. Uh, your social security number. A fruit used in pies. Apple. Try again. Cherry. A sign of the zodiac. Uh, Pisces. A kind of stew. Beef. Try again. Uh, chicken. Turn around. What do you tip a delivery boy for carrying the groceries? You said a dollar. Survey said. Eight. Fifty cents, number one answer. Something you should know by heart. You said social security number. Survey said. Ten. The national anthem, number one answer. Uh, police come up to you and ask you. You say, oh, say, <laughs> can you? Fruit used in pies, you said. Jerry, survey said. Eighteen. Apple was number one. Then the sign of the zodiac. You said, Pisces survey said, 12. 
Libra was a number one, and then a kind of stew. You said a chicken stew. You're 47 points away, survey set. Zero. Beef was number one, 153, five dollars for every point. Total up. Seven hundred and sixty-five dollars. We'll be back right after this. Now, see, when people think of GEICO, right, they think of car insurance and, of course, saving money. But sometimes that can lead even the savviest driver astray. Take, for example, the motorcycle owner. He calls GEICO wanted to save money on his car insurance, only to realise that he doesn't actually own a car. Well, needless to say, he's quite embarrassed, isn't he? Doesn't matter. GEICO insures motorcycles and ATVs as well. That way, no one ends up looking foolish. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Oh, no. Can't find your phone in that cluttered handbag? Searching for those house keys again. Do you have to dig and dump to find what you're looking for? Then you need the over-the-shoulder expandable organizer from Buxton. Makers of fine leather goods since 1898. It's the biggest little bag ever that holds it all and keeps it organized so you find what you need in a flash. Crafted of supple, genuine leather, the Buxton Organizer has this outer pouch for your phone. You'll never miss a call again. Hello? Don't lug around a heavy tote. Watch as the Buxton Organizer turns this jumbled mess into an organized success. And it's expandable. Store two regular-sized water bottles and an umbrella. Amazing. With the Buxton Organizer, you're hands-free, making travel a breeze and shopping a pleasure. Look, a regular handbag can get stolen, but with Buxton Organizer's adjustable shoulder strap, it's always secure. There's a special wallet compartment for easy reach and handy slots for your credit cards. You'll be so organized, you can even find what you need with a blindfold. You could pay over $100 for a similar designer bag. Call now and get the Buxton over-the-shoulder organizer in genuine leather for only $19.95. There's more. We'll also send you the digital message reminder, the compact recorder that records without tape. Butter, milk, eggs. Then remind you later. Butter, milk, eggs. It's perfect for directions, at work, even the parking lot. Yours free, just pay processing and handling. And ask about the Buxton Organizer in these fashion colors. Get the Buxton Expandable Organizer and the Digital Message Reminder, all for only $19.95. Call now. To order your Buxton over-the-shoulder bag, call 1-800-672-3707. Remember, call now and get the free Digital Message Reminder free. Just pay processing and handling. So call 1-800-672-3707. It's okay if you draw a blank on Match Game. Then, don't pass on the fun with Password Plus, followed by the crazy whammies and fast-paced gameplay on Whammy, all coming up next. We don't know what you're going to do. We're going to have some uh, chicken stew. Bye-bye. <laughs> I'm going to say a moth. You're going to say a moth. I got to ask you this, Joe. Mm-hmm. Is that your final answer? Yeah. He just won a million dollars! Get ready to match the stars. Richard Deacon. Rex Summers. From the love boat, Fred Grundy. From the ladies' man, Louise Sorrell. Bill Daly. And from Flo, Joyce Beulabach as we play the star-studded Big Money Match Game. And now, here's the star of Match Game, Gene Raven! Thank you, John. Thank you, friends. <laughs> I brought my own today. Thank you, all right. Well, I'll use yours, John, if you want me to. Throw it in here, that a boy. And you Good know the catch. tradition here, when we have a new kid on the block, we have to welcome that person properly. Oh, and uh, uh, we don't want to offend at any time. Yeah. Hey, Chris is great. I really feel like this. <laughs> I remember when I was new, it was really no, nice. uh, mm. I think she's going to be wonderful on the show, and we're going to have her back over and over and over again and pretend it's the first time every time. <laughs> welcome, Louise. Thank you. Now let's all welcome Ross Birdsall and Jan Zebley. <laughs> now let's 
Okay, quite a bit of the two of you here. Jan, we'll begin with you. Anything you want to tell us about yourself? I'm from Roseville, California, which is up near Sacramento. I have a son that's 13 months, and I'm married. It's a good thing. And um, <laughs> I'm a dental hygienist. And you have uh, nice teeth. Thank you. <laughs> tell the world they're mine. Oh, they're beautiful. They're all his. <laughs> okay, thank you, Jan. Thank you. Ross, what about you, sir? Well, I'm a associate development engineer at the at UCLA Laboratory of Nuclear Medicine, the uh, biomedical cyclotron there. And I have uh, four children, live in Fullerton, California. I love backpacking, and I do occasional jogging. Where do you backpack? Well, I generally up in the Sierras. We were up there about two weeks ago or so, and above Rock Creek Lake. Just beautiful country. Did some fishing. Yep. Just outstanding. Nature Just is wonderful. Oh, it's beautiful. Just but beautiful. you scientists aren't going to screw up the world with your I nuclear hope not. stuff. I hope not. I hope not. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Here we go. Game one, round one. Jan, A or B? A, please. A it is. Here we go. At the antique shop, Ralph said, this piece of sheet music has got to be fake. Who ever heard of a disco song written by blank? <laughs> Do you understand? I got one. Gotcha, Fred. All right. You what? You're very low. What can we do to get her high? No, I ain't. I've been a boozer. I'm gonna get this. Well, wait a minute. Tina. She meant low down. Oh, very your low chair down. is low. Would, would you change seats with her? You're taller than she is. All right, just take a seat. No, no. Right. Let's see. Let's move this one over there. I got the train backwards once because I heard a guy was going to grab my seat. <laughs> wait a minute. This is too high. Let's move this up there. All right, let's get it out here. <laughs> At the antique shop, Ralph said this piece of sheet music has got to be fake. Who ever heard of a disco song written by blank? Beethoven? Beethoven. <laughs> now, why would, why would anyone say Beethoven over Mozart or Bach or Brahms or any of the others? Well, probably because they're they're intelligent. Beethoven. Beethoven, Beethoven. right. <laughs> what do you say? I didn't say Beethoven, and I didn't say Mozart, I didn't say any of those what things. What did you say? I said Mr. Johann Sebastian Bach. Right. He would be a more gen generic, I believe. He created... Uh, well, da, 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 da. Generic, did a lot of fugues. Deaf. Beethoven yes. wrote that stuff after he was deaf, so he wouldn't have to listen to it. Uh -huh. <laughs> you, know what, you know what Bach was famous, famous for? What was Bach famous for? Fuging. <laughs> you better wrote a lot of cubes. Right, all right. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this piece of one sheet... to five, what do you think? <laughs> Minus Something along these lines. <laughs> <laughs> this piece of sheet music has got to be fake. Whoever had heard of a disco song written by... Same as Brett. Bach. Bach. Sorry. All right. Two Why is that a bad answer? Because he's older. You said very old antique. I'm sorry. Uh, I like to. Have, I like to have my chair bop. <laughs> what is this? Uh, bop. I'm sorry. Another bop. Right. What happened? This chair is weird. It is a chair. Uh, we can fix it. Did they just unscrew from the bottom or something? Yeah. Let's fix it. Let's get it up there. Oh, no, no, don't sit down. This on is cards. really boring. Can't hey, we unscrew this chair with a gold? My life here? is really boring. <laughs> this is more boring than my life. Let's get the chair higher. Unscrew the chair. Let's just bring this down a little farther. Oh, must sit be. down and shut up. Must I be. am sitting down. <laughs> I'm standing. That's how low this chair is. Let's see. Have we... Have, yes. Oh, we're finished. Have we we're finished. We're finished. We're call on Joyce. She's That's the last the one. <laughs> Piece of sheet music got to be fake. Whoever heard of a disco song written by... Brahms. Brahms. Oh. Oh. 
alcohol and everything. Thank you very much. Ah. All right. Oh, look at this. Yes. <laughs> don't hurt her. Oh, don't hurt her back. That's don't her. her I wish this bit had never started. <laughs> Good. I don't like this. All right. Are you ready? Here we go. Is this masquerade? No. <laughs> Sid said, I'm going to sell my car and start walking. So I bought the only pair of shoes in the world equipped with a blank. <laughs> Good. Good. Thank you. Good. All right. Sell my car and start walking. So I bought the only pair of shoes in the world equipped with a pair of roller skates. First thing that came to his mind. What's the first thing that came to your mind? Wheels. What a pair of shoes with wheels. Well, that's roller skates. Ding bats. What do you say? I said headlights. Headlights. No, first that's logical. Come on. Perfectly all right. All right. What do you say, Brett? What do I say? Yeah. I want out of here. I want out of here now. I can go have a better time at Camarillo State Hospital. <laughs> Was it ladies' day? <laughs> I said a very small engine. A very small engine, all right. I said a 380 horsepower engine. A 380 horsepower engine. All right, the only pair of shoes in the world equipped with a... An air conditioner. An air conditioner, right. You need it there. All right. Uh, <laughs> a spare tire. A spare tire. Better than a pool. Right. A pair of roller skates is what we're after here. You are? Yep. I don't got it. I have an engine. An uh, engine. <laughs> All right. So there's round one. Jan's ahead. Two to nothing. Round two coming up in a moment. Now this for you. Look what's happening in Little Tykes Land. This is the Smarter Kitchen. The Little Tykes Kitchen. Measuring, mixing, just like Mom. Put the pink frosting on the cake. You got it right. Now that's the Smart Kitchen. Little Tykes Cook and Learn Kitchen. Accessory pack sewed separately. Batteries not included. Ouch. Tired of getting nicks and cuts from blades that go ooh, dull after just a few shaves? Now there's an easy way to save your money and your skin no matter what razor you use. Introducing Save a Blade, the ingenious razor sharpener that can give you up to 200 perfect shaves from a single blade. That's 40 times longer per blade. Just slide the razor inside, press the button, and in seconds, your razor blade is like new again. It's truly like turning one razor blade into 40 brand new blades, saving you hundreds of dollars every year and giving you the perfect shave every time. The same technology used in commercial kitchens to sharpen and hone fine cutlery has now been adapted for the razor. Barber shops have always sharpened and honed their blades for the smoothest shaves, but the razor companies don't want us to know that we can too. Save a Blade Secret is our patented micro honing technology that sweeps across the blade at 60 revolutions per second to sharpen and renew your blade in one simple step. It works on all razors, men's, women's, cartridges, single blades, all the way up to five blade razors, even disposables. Independent laboratory testing proved that after 200 shaves, a razor sharpened with Save a Blade was virtually identical to a brand new blade. It's like shaving with a brand new razor every time. So why put up with cuts from dull blades when you can save your money and your skin with Save a Blade? But wait, you get the dual head personal trimmer. Great for men and women in all areas. Nose, ears, neck, even the bikini area. But that's not all. You'll also receive our deluxe his and hers 18-piece grooming kit. It includes every grooming tool you need to always look your best. That's right. You get the Save a Blade razor sharpener and our dual-headed personal trimmer and our deluxe 18-piece grooming kit. A $60 value for only $19.99. Have your credit card ready and call 1-800-807-4216 to order Save a Blade for $19.99 plus shipping and handling. Or send check or money order to the address on your screen. That's 1-800-807-4216. Call today. Attention, all persons eligible for Medicare. Now you can get comprehensive prescription drug coverage for about a dollar a day. With Humana's drug plan, members saved an average of over $1,000 on their prescription costs last year. Call now to learn how you can start saving money on prescription drug coverage from a company that's been serving people with Medicare for more than 20 years. 
You can pick up your prescriptions right at your neighborhood pharmacy or use our money-saving home delivery service. And you get a personalized statement that summarizes your prescription drug spending with tips on how you may be able to save even more. Just call 1-800-705-1485 now and get your free copy of The Power to Save that shows how you can save money on prescription drugs. So call 1-800-705-1485. That's 1-800-705-1485. Starting next week, be a part of the celebration. Your favorite stars are playing for their favorite charities. And Wheel of Fortune celebrating 25 years with People Celebrity Week from the historic Radio City Music Hall. Check your local listings for time and channel. Here we go. All right, round two coming up. And Jan, since you're ahead, you go first. A, please. Four people play. Brett in the lower tier. Harvey is the world's strangest dresser. Who asked you? <laughs> I'll tell you when. Today, he's wearing one blue sock and one green sock. What's strange is, he's wearing them on his blank. <laughs> Harvey is the world's strangest dresser, Jan. Today, he's wearing one blue sock and one green sock. What's strange is he's wearing them on his... Ears. Ears. <laughs> All right, Brad, what'd you say? Oh, little ear muffets. Ears. Strange <laughs> dresser. Now she's up to three. Louise, what finally came to your mind? You had a little trouble thinking about it. My little mind? Yes. Fern. Fern. <laughs> oh, that's right. That's... Makes no sense whatsoever. Well, that's what you say when you can't think of an answer. Now, you can't nice. boo a pretty girl like that. Yeah. You really can't. <laughs> Unless you're booing his answer in advance, because you know it's going to be so dreadful. <laughs> what? The ears have it. The ears have it. All right. Here is Ross Birdsall, probably the <laughs> smartest guy within a radius of 20 miles, being beaten by Jan Zebley here. <laughs> so far. Now, Ross, you could tie it with five or win it with six. Okay. At the racetrack, Martha said, This weather is really terrible. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you, we've had so much rain, the jockeys are riding blanks. <laughs> That's how terrible the weather is. Did I see that? Like that? <laughs> 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 the racetrack Martha said, this weather is really terrible. We've had so much rain, the jockeys are riding blanks. Water skis. Water skis. <laughs> That's an interesting sight. They're, the horses are pulling them along on the water skis. As one hairless man to another, I said rafts. Rafts. <laughs> Got to match everybody else, Ross. Let's see what you have, Brett. Well, you see, I started to say uh, side saddle. But I figured that wasn't going to make a bit no. of sense. That's nothing to do with the rain. No, oh, no. I said rowboats. Rowboats. Yes. All right. So that means Jan wins the game. What the rest of you Hold up your cards. Duck. Yeah. Money. You got a lot of rooters out there? Who'd you bring? Uh, my brother, my sister in law, and a couple friends. They're all here, huh? Yeah. They're the one going, woo hoo! Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah, got a bunch of woo hooers in your family. All right, Jan, we pulled a studio audience not too long ago and said, write down your best answer to this blank lemon. Oh, sure. $500 for the most popular answer. $250 for matching the second most popular answer, and then we give you $100 if you match the third. Whom do you uh, call on for a little help here? Brett. Oh, the cutest little actor in town, Jack Lemon. All right, there's one. Brett. These are verbal, you don't put them in the thing oh. there. Uh, how about uh, Bitter Lemon? Yeah. Bitter Lemon. Yeah. Could tell what kind of a drinker he is. Yes, Joyce? So 
sour lemon. Yeah. Yeah. Bitter lemon, sour lemon, and jack lemon. You want one of those or one of your own? I think I'm going to go with one of them. I'll go with Brett. Jack. Jack lemon. All right. We've got a jack lemon. Let's find out if it's under the $100 response. Meadowlark Lemon, famous player with the Harlem Globetrotters. You know? Bum, 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 bum. Sweet Georgia Brown. Uh, thank you very much for the background music. Now, let's take a look at the $250 response. Jack Lemon, it is. Well, I thought that was going to be on top. I'll bet you are. <laughs> okay, slide the big one. Dan, you're still going to be playing for a minimum of $2,500, maybe $5,000. We'll find out which it will be right after we find out about this. And we've got fun and games, Sim Brett's big frames, big beehive hair, and Regis in the chair. Dawson's giving kisses and trying to find a missus. Weekends are when your favorite shows are on GSN. Are you feeling old and tired? Do you want to get that jump back in your step? Hey, I'm Don Shula, and I lost 32 pounds on Nutrisystem. And I'm Marianne Shula, and I've lost 23 pounds. Introducing Nutrisystem Silver, the weight loss program that lets older Americans eat great and lose weight. Let's face it, the older you get, the harder it is to lose weight. Not anymore, honey. It's easy with Nutrisystem. Call or go online now to order four weeks of delicious meals and love the way you look. And through this special offer, your order will automatically be delivered once every four weeks. And you can get an extra two weeks of Nutrisystem Silver meals free. I look and feel so much better, and so does Coach. I'm back to my playing way. Our secret is the breakthrough science of the glycemic advantage that separates good carbs from bad. Now carbs are no longer off limits. This is the kind of food you grew up loving. Pizza, burgers, lasagna. Every perfectly portioned Nutrisystem meal is delivered right to your door, and your shipping is free. With Nutrisystem, there's no counting, no measuring, and no embarrassing weigh-ins. It's a no-brainer program. If you want real results, the kind that make you look better and feel your best, then you have to order Nutrisystem Silver today. People say I look 10 years younger. Hey, I feel 10 years younger. I'm 77 years old, and I feel great. Plus, it's affordable. For about $10 a day, you'll enjoy four weeks of perfectly portioned meals. But there's more. Order our four-week silver program now, and you can get an extra 14 breakfast, 14 lunches, 14 dinners, and 14 desserts. A full two weeks of food absolutely free. Get back in the game. As an added bonus, you'll receive a month's supply of our specially formulated vitamins tailored for the dietary needs of older Americans. Trust me, you will lose weight. See how Nutrisystem Silver can change your body and get a full two weeks of food and these vitamins free. Call now to find out how. Every day we use signs to inform us and help us make decisions at a glance. So why are the signs so complicated when it comes to choosing the food we eat? Kellogg's cereals now include guideline daily amounts, which shows, at a glance, what's in a serving of Kellogg's cereal and the percentage it contributes to your daily diet. Nutrition at a glance. It's a good sign. From Kellogg's. Fact. You're receiving a structured settlement from a lawsuit. Fact. It's being paid out over years. Question. Should you wait to get your money down the road? Or get a cash lump sum now. Call Peachtree Settlement Funding. Get cash for credit cards, medical bills, or a down payment on a house. No one has more expertise than Peachtree in turning your structured settlement into cash today. And that's a fact. Life doesn't wait. Why should you? Call now. 1-800-693-7905. Here we go. James won the $250. That means Alicia will play for us $2,500. However, we do want her to spin the wheel and see if she can double it up and play instead for $5,000. Good luck, and here we go and see if she gets a double. <laughs> Thank you.
You're playing for a double for $5,000 with Fred Dandy. Who? And his brother, oh, Brandy. Oh, I'm matching my last name. You might be a friend. <laughs> All right, here it is. Blank Lobster. No help, please, because your answer may be the wrong answer, and uh, you could lead her astray. How much time have I got, Jane? Oh, that's about it. All right, he's ready. Now, if you give us the answer that he's written on the card, we give you $5,000. What do you say to that? Steak and? Steak and lobster. <laughs> Your brother is the only one clapping. <laughs> Fred, she said steak and lobster to match you. Yeah, well, I'm from New England, and I always took my lobster boiled. Boiled lobster. Boiled? Sorry. Boiled, boiled lobster. Boiled? That's the traditional way of cooking a lobster. That's a traditional way of cooking a lobster. What? 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 Rock lobster? Rock? What lobster? I've never heard of you ever heard lobster. of a rock lobster? No. What is he, some kind of rock star? What? Oh, punk rock. Oh. We're dealing with a bunch of weirdos here today, aren't we? All right. Now, Jam, we're going to bring your opponent back here and play game number two. So let's welcome back. Hey, Ross. She's got a total of $250. And uh, we're ready to start the second and final game if you are. Sir, you okay. may go first with A or B. B, please. B it is. B says, Bart said, times have really changed. I went into a pet shop to buy a parrot, but instead of saying Polly wants a cracker, that bird said Polly wants a blank. <laughs> the times have really changed. You want him to be a female? You want him to be a female? Sure, then he's, he's a female. Ready up here? Times have really changed. I went into a pet shop to buy a parrot, but instead of saying Polly wants a cracker, that bird said Polly wants a blank. A pizza. A pizza. Uh, very good, Ross. <laughs> Cute answer, huh? Uh-huh. I don't think he's as up to date as he should be. Hit or joint. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what do you say? Shh. Yes. Pizza? Pizza. <laughs> Shoot us a button, but before you're a loser here today, <laughs> joint. Uh. I don't like those responses. I just wonder about these two questions. people, the deans of show business, doing dope jokes on TV. Right. <laughs> How about a sauna and a massage? All right. Yeah. It's that cute. Polly wants a sauna and a massage there. Louise, what do you want? Well, I'm back in the 50s. A drink. <laughs> a drink. Okay. Billy Boy? Uh, I would like my funny chair back, please. <laughs> this is a, a rye crisp. Now, don't, don't do the oh, rye crisp. Booby! Okay. You're right. You're very intelligent. Good yeah. audience. Yes, Miss Joyce. I said, <laughs> Polly wants another bird. <laughs> <laughs> Well, all right, Jan, we'll have a question for you in a moment or so, but right now we have this for you, America. It's GSN's new four-hour happy hour. You can get together with your friends, have some laughs, and check out the hotties. But watch out for the whammy. The four-hour happy hour. Four hours of your favorite game shows back-to-back. -back. Weekday afternoon starting at 3 on GSN. Horrorfest 2007. Eight films to die for. The ultimate horror event. One week only, November 9th through 18th. For ticket information, go to horrorfestonline.com. Look what's happening in Little Tykes Land. Little Tykes has the coolest workshop. You flip it over and it's two and one. Put up on one side and motor shop on the other. Whoa! It has realistic power tools. So, grinder, drill. Little Tykes Build and to Learn Workshop. Better's not included. 
Duncan Hines introduces Oven Ready Homestyle Brownies. They go straight from the freezer to the oven to delicious. Duncan Hines Oven Ready Homestyle Brownies. The breakthrough for brownie lovers. Some toilet paper is soft, uh -oh. but not very strong. Others are strong, Yikes. but not very soft. Cottonelle Ultra Toilet Paper is both soft mm. and strong. Dreamy. So, Miss Code Authority, what's hot? Rich wool, that's hot. Sporty ski jackets, that's hot. Saving money, that's hot. Save big on top brand coats for everyone. Burlington Coat Factory, the Coat Authority. Did you know there's a product specifically designed for managing bladder weakness overnight? It's Tennis Serenity Overnight Pads. The pad is wider in the front and back to protect you while you're lying down. But that's not all. A cotton-like top sheet and super absorbent core manage liquid to keep you dry, while Tennis Unique Odazor Plus fights odors. Have a better night's sleep. Choose a product specially designed to do a better job. Tennis Serenity Overnight Pads. Call 1-877-GET-TENNA for your free sample. Brand Power, helping you buy better. Cholesterol. It can come from a casserole, creamy tuna and peas, and your grandmother, Louise. From mom's lasagna, extra cheesy, and your pop, Petey. A healthy diet is important. When that's not enough, adding Vitorin can help. Cholesterol comes from two sources, food and family. Vitorin treats two sources. Only Vitorin helps block the absorption of cholesterol from food and reduces the cholesterol your body makes naturally. Vitorin was also proven in clinical studies to lower bad cholesterol more than Lipitor alone, more than Crestor alone. Vitorin is not for everyone, including people with liver problems, women who are nursing, pregnant, or may become pregnant. Tell your doctor right away about unexplained muscle pain or weakness, which may be a sign of a rare but serious side effect. Certain medicines or foods may increase your risk of getting this serious side effect. Simple blood tests are needed to check for liver problems. So eat right, stay active, but if that's not enough, ask your doctor about adding Vitorin, two sources of cholesterol. Treat them both with Vitorin. What is that word? Play along with Password Plus next. After that, take a spin and you could win with Whammy. Followed by the original Whammy on Press Your Luck. Stay tuned. All right. You were all splendid. I thought she did quite well for you her were first day. I thought she was a adorable. Wasn't she grand? Yes. Right. It was hog heaven. Very yes. Nice. What's, <laughs> what is the name of the show that you're going to be doing? Ladies' Man. Ladies' Man. And it's uh, Betty Kennedy's on it, right? Betty Kennedy is on it. And who else? And Simone Griffith and Lawrence Pressman and Karen Morrow. Oh. And Natasha Ryan. Oh. And... All those ladies. All those ladies. Wonderful. I love Karen Morrow. Yes, yeah. they're all great. All right, we'll be here tomorrow for Match Game, and I hope you will be too. I'm Gene Rayburn. Thank you. Goodbye. The weekends are when your favorite shows are on GSM. We've got fun and games. Sam Brett's big frames, big beehive hair. And Regis in the chair. Dawson's giving kisses and trying to find a missus. Don't pick a stopper or a big belly flopper. Always for the whammy and Carnes is acting hammy. Roger, test your brain and the handsome Dylan Lane. Weekends are when your favorite shows are on GSN. It's more than password, it's password plus. Our guest stars. Linda K. Henning and Dick Martin. And here's the star of Password Plus, Alan Lennon. Hi, Dom. Hi, Dick. Hi, Dick. Oh, we're winding up five good days with you good oh. people. You're going to be directing the Steve Lawrence special here on yes. NBC, right? On NBC. And, in, uh, and Lawrence is going to be doing comedy. You're doing, doing comedy, and Edie's going to be a guest. Isn't that going to yeah. be great? They don't do anything bad, though. You're They're so funny. Talented. And you're going to direct. Yes. Good director, good actor, and you're going to be doing, you are doing it this very moment. Pajama, Pajama game. Pajama game down in San Diego. So see it. Let's beat our current players, Virginia and Paul. Come in. Virginia Sanchez is our current champion over here. Virginia has $900 and to $100 in the current game. Wow. Tell us again about yourself, Virginia. Well, I'm a mother and a wife of two daughters, and I'm a part-time secretary, and right now we're in the process of moving up near Fraser Park. Well, it's good to have you here. Thank now, you. here's a young man. Where are you from, Paul? Paul McCullough. I'm from New York City. And what are you doing out here? 
I'm hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> you having a good time? Yeah. Well, who are you I'm visiting out? my brother. My brother is out here. Uh-huh. And what do you do in New York? I work part-time in a hospital, and I do a bunch of different things. And I teach this thing called psychocalisthenics on occasion. Uh-huh. Uh, what's, what's that? I do a little work with daycare with some problem children. Uh-huh. It's all, you know, a little bit here and there. <laughs> all right. Would you like to play a little bit of password here and there? <laughs> okay. We have $100 here, $100 here. This is a $200 puzzle. Whoever wins this puzzle wins the game, goes on to alphabetics. Linda Kay has the options to begin. The first clue in the $200 puzzle you've got there. Gonna pass or play, Linda Kay? I'll play it. Go. Athletics. Sports. That's it. Yeah. Beautiful. Wow. First clue in a puzzle is sports. What do you think it is? Astrodome. Is it the Astrodome? No. Dick has the option. Here we go. Second clue in the $200 puzzle. Pass or play, Dick? Uh... I'll pass. Okay, Linda Kay. Tournament. Contest. Second clue. Uh, the players. Game. Third clue, Linda Kay. Vying. Com competition. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. That's, That's good. a toughie. All right. That's, That's a, a tough, tough word. word yeah. 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 For the game. This is for the game. Two clues, sports and competition. Super Bowl. Is it the Super Bowl? No. Here we go. Dick has the option. You've got it. Uh, Wait a minute. Do they have it? Now they have it. Now they have it. Pass or play? I will play. All right. Global. Worldly. Second clue, Linda. Total. Home. Last clue for you, Dick. Uh, uh, global. Universal. <clears throat> Fourth and last clue, Linda. Oh, that's close. Um, nationalities. International. Yeah. yeah. International. Paul McCullough for the game. For the game, three clues. Sports, competition, and international. Is it the Olympics? Is it the Olymp Olympics? Yeah! the game. Virginia Sanchez, we have to say goodbye to you, but we do so with a thousand dollars and a thank gift, you. and we thank you very much. Thank You've you. You've been a delightful yeah. player. Yeah. Definition of the word, yeah. the word yeah. Paul, we're going to play in your alphabetics. Are you ready? Are you ready for alphabetics? I'm ready. All right. <laughs> Can you wait for a commercial? No. Oh, please do. we got to have the commercial. We'll be right back. <laughs> Oh, no. Can't find your phone in that cluttered handbag? Searching for those house keys again. Do you have to dig and dump to find what you're looking for? Then you need the over-the-shoulder expandable organizer from Buxton. Makers of fine leather goods since 1898. It's the biggest little bag ever that holds it all and keeps it organized so you find what you need in a flash. Crafted of supple, genuine leather, the Buxton Organizer has this outer pouch for your phone. You'll never miss a call again. Hello? Don't lug around a heavy tote. Watch as the Buxton Organizer turns this jumbled mess into an organized success. And it's expandable. Store two regular-sized water bottles and an umbrella. Amazing. With the Buxton Organizer, you're hands-free, making travel a breeze and shopping a pleasure. Look, a regular handbag can get stolen, but with Buxton Organizer's adjustable shoulder strap, it's always secure. There's a special wallet compartment for easy reach and handy slots for your credit cards. You'll be so organized, you can even find what you need with a blindfold. You could pay over $100 for a similar designer bag. Call now and get the Buxton Over-the-Shoulder Organizer in genuine leather for only $19.95. There's more. We'll also send you the digital message reminder, the compact recorder that records without tape. Butter, milk, eggs. Then remind you later. Butter, milk, eggs. It's perfect for directions. At work, even the parking lot. Yours free. Just pay processing and handling. And ask about the Buxton Organizer in these fashion colors. Get the Buxton Expandable Organizer and the Digital Message Reminder. All for only $19.95. Call now. To order your Buxton over-the-shoulder bag, call 1-800-672-3707. Remember, call now and get the free digital message reminder free. Just pay processing and handling. So call 1-800-672-3707.
Uh, is that the way you spell it, McCullough? Yeah. Okay. All right, Paul McCullough. Going to play alphabetic for the first time. Ten passwords up there, arranged alphabetically, starting with the letter M and going alphabetically all the way through to the letter V. You get ten of them in 60 seconds. You got $5,000. Could you use it? Sure could. <laughs> all right, let's see what we can do for you. You ready to go? Remember, the first word starts with M. There's the first word, Linda Kay. You got your clue? You all set? You got a clue? Mm-hmm. You ready? Okay, you're going to have 60 seconds. Ready? Go. Restaurant. Maitre d'. Order. Menu. N. Head. Nurse. Below. Neck. O. Fat. Obese. P. Uh, quill. Quill pen. Q. Um, mm, uh, Klugman. Uh, um. Jack. Uh, Quincy. Pathology. Quincy. R. Uh, Juliet. Romeo. S. Um, bite. Snarl. B. Sting. T. Uh, cigarette. Smoke. Oh, Inside. Tea. Tobacco. U. Nations. Uh, United Nations. B. Uh, mean. Vicious. You. <laughs> You had positive. I had a hunch he was going to do it. Any, did you at home? Did, did you think this guy was going to do it? I felt like he was going to do it. He had a very positive attitude. So you have five thousand three hundred dollars, and congratulations. Absolutely. And you get to play again. Come on over here. Let's play again. This time you're with Dick. All right. Yeah. Oh. So let's leave it right there. Okay. All right. Let's meet our new player, shall we? Her name is Linda Buell. Come in, Linda. Oh, yeah. You sit down right here. Is it Buell, Linda? That's it. Buell. Tell us about yourself, Linda. I live in the San Francisco area with my husband and my three sweet sons, and I play tennis. You play tennis? <laughs> tennis. Did you, did you come down here just to play passport? Yes, I sure did. You applied from there and came down to play? That's right. Well, I'm glad you got on. Let's do it. You ready to go? You've seen this young man play. You know how he does oh, it. Oh, yes. Okay, here we go. Brand new competition. First clue in the first puzzle. Linda has the option. There you go. You're going to pass or play, Linda? I will play. Okay. Crucifix. Cross. That's it, Linda. Good. I got Linda and Linda Linda and Linda. Here. What a team. Linda <laughs> Kay and Linda Buell. All right. First clue in the puzzle, Linda Buell, is cross. Is it the crucifixion? Is it the crucifixion? No, it isn't. All right. You've got the option this time, Dick. All right. There's the second clue in the puzzle. Pass or play, Dick? Um... Pass. All right, Linda Kay. Valentine. Card. Second clue. Uh, thumping. Heart. Right. Heart. Right. <laughs> All right, Paul. Two clues. Cross and heart. Uh, gee. Uh, is it a, a... No, it isn't. <laughs> All right, here we go. Linda Kay has the option. There's the third clue in the puzzle. Pass or play. I'll play. All right. Alive. Healthy. Second clue. I'm sorry, what was... Alive. Alive. She said alive. Um... Um... Uh, room. Birth. Third clue, Linda Kay. Last for you. Breathing. Delivery. <laughs> oh! Um... <laughs> Last clue. Um, dining. Living. Living. Right. Out of boy. All right, Paul, you added it up. Cross, heart, and living. What do you uh, think it is? Is it a bra? <laughs> is it a bra? <laughs> Oh, I'm out of the living that's bra. Right, oh, that's well, a good I guess. Like your mind works. Okay? I do too. He's gonna I, be all right. I've seen, I've seen the ad. He, he said, you don't have to describe it any more than that. All right. Here we go. Linda Kay has the option. Fourth clue. Pass or play. I'll play. All right. <laughs> Maiden form bra. All right, Linda. <laughs> now you've got four clues up there. 
cross, heart, living in bra. Playtex. Is it Playtex? Yeah. Oh. Uh, would you have known I've worn Playtex bra before, but then uh, I just said bra. All right, you thought of Playtex, though. All right, well, she got it. Oh. Okay, but you have a shot, because it's only 100, and it takes three to win. We have a commercial. We'll be right back. Don't go away. Men, such simple creatures. <laughs> so vain. Oh, yeah. Insecure. Silence, I am in control. Always needing approval. I didn't get my third kiss. No wonder we can't get enough of them. The men from GSN. Weekday starting at 9, 8 Central. You think you're smart? Check this out. What letter is missing here? Polyglot. Or how about this one? Hyperbole. You gotta be pretty quick these days. Now, if this brain exercise has sparked your interest, let me introduce you to My Word Coach. My Word Coach is a fun vocabulary video game that'll strengthen your business communication skills and give you more confidence. Jam-packed with 17,000 of the most descriptive words you wanna know, My Word Coach customizes each game to you and scientifically helps you learn new words faster. You can even track your progress. Play My Word Coach, and you'll be learning and entertained for days, weeks, maybe forever. Is that a hyperbole? I think My Word Coach definitely helped me to get that job as an English teacher. So while you're playing, you're learning. Easy to play, easy to follow, and it's fun. So get smart. Play My Word Coach. It's easy to learn with My Word Coach. You can also learn Spanish with My Spanish Coach. Rated E for everyone. Jed Clampett, a poor mountaineer barely keeping his family fed, when in the summer of 63, he was shooting at some food, becoming a millionaire overnight. Soon afterward, he loaded up his truck and moved to Beverly Hills. I was suspicious of this whole Texas tea theory. A new investigation reveals that in the summer before Jed moved away from there, he switched his car insurance to Geico, saving a substantial sum of money. Geico, 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Look what's happening in Little Types Land. Little Types has the coolest workshop. You flip it over and it's two and one. Put you up on one side and motor shop on the other. Whoa! It has realistic power tools, saw, grinder, drill, and lots of other fun stuff. Plus a bonus car project. Put together the engine, supercharge the motor. I learn all about tools. And Dad likes that. Woodshop, motor shop. Little Types building the learn workshop. Better not include it. Okay, we're okay. back. $100 for the ladies. Men against the ladies here, you know? Uh -huh. Okay, Linda and Paul are going to be giving Linda Buell, that is, and Paul are giving the clues this time. Paul has the option. You got to pass or play, Paul? Uh, I'll pass. Okay, Linda Buell. Elasticy. Stretchy. Second clue, Paul. Uh, gummy. Sticky. That's third clue, Linda. Tires. Rubbery. Yeah, yeah, rubbery. Very good. All right, Linda Kay. First clue in the puzzle is rubbery. What do you think? Hmm, rubbery. Uh, tires. Is it tires? <laughs> Not tires. Paul, you have the option again. There you go. Second clue in the puzzle. Pass or play, Paul? I'll play. Okay. Elasticy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, stretchy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, two clues, rubbery and stretchy. I'd say girdle. Is it a girdle? No. Oh. All right, we took care of that. Line. Linda yeah. Briel has the option. <laughs> pass or play? I'll pass. Okay, Paul. Uh, Edie. <laughs> E.T.? E.T. E.T. E uh, um... Munchy. Linda? Bite. Chewy? Yes! Oh, yeah. Chewy, that's very good. Chewy. Rubbery, stretchy. All right, chewy. rubbery, stretchy, and chewy. Sounds kind of silly, doesn't it? It sure does. What do you think? Could it be chewing gum? Is or it gum? Is it gum? Not gum. Hmm. All right. Paul has the option. You've got it. Pass or play, Paul? Um... Pass. Linda. Color. Red. Paul. Dark. Black. Yes. 
Two. Now, Dick, four clues. Rubbery, stretchy, chewy, and black. Licorice. Mm -hmm. Is it licorice? Yes! Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Two hundred dollars. The last one. Yeah, that was a good that was yeah. a good one. All right. Oh, dear. Here we go. One hundred to one hundred. Whoever gets this one wins the game, goes on to alphabetics. Linda K has the option. There's the first clue in our two hundred dollar puzzle. What are you going to do, Linda Gay? I will play. Go ahead. Cookbooks, recipes. Very good. Oh, Very good. Girl. All right. First clue on the puzzle. Linda is recipe for $200 in the game. What? Gourmet. Is it a gourmet? No, that's Dick Martin. Here we go. <laughs> Dick has the option. You've got it. Second clue. Dick, pass or play? Uh, play. All right. Female. Woman. Right. Sure. Paul, now you have two clues. Recipe and woman. Yeah? Yeah. Guess. Is it uh, Julia Child? Is it Julia Child? No. Good guess. Good guess. Good guess. Good guess. All right, Linda Kay has the option. Pass.